At Polly's Hotel Bar here on Central Avenue in Albany. It's open mic night here, so they have a pretty good crowd. But if you go to other bars around the area, it's pretty empty. Because let's face it, unless you're giving away free beer, live entertainment is your biggest draw. But a lot of local musicians who depend on these bars are upset because the city is trying to regulate it. Olivia Quilio is one of hundreds of Albany artists who rely on bars just like Polly's to release their talent and make some money. This is like our vitality. This is like what you live off of. They're concerned about the proposed cabaret law, which would require all businesses that want to have live entertainment to pay between $300 and $900 a year for a license. If just a handful of bars stop having live music, will that still have an effect? Absolutely. Not to be cliche, is this a circle of life sort of thing? There's a system to this. If there aren't events, there won't be drinks bought, there won't be tips, there won't be hours. Elvis is already one bar feeling the pinch. It's virtually empty because law enforcement said they were not properly zoned for live entertainment. If just one event shuts down, people have to relocate and rethink, and there's a huge community of artists here. Elda said, when you've been doing business in the same location for a dozen years, it should be the city bending over backwards for you, not the other way around. She doesn't want to apply for a new license. Because I've been here for so long, and I have, and I'm not going to lose what I have. And I don't think it's a fair for any business in Albany to for the been in business more than 10 years. But the owner of Polly said, if you want to succeed, you have to conform with the new city laws. Oh, well, there are a lot of fees in New York State, and it, I guess it's just part of doing business, unfortunately. Now, we've been told by the musicians here that the last 24 hours, they've had more than 800 signatures sign a petition against having this new law instated. Of course, there will be an official city meeting regarding the cabaret law happening on February 15th. Live in Albany, Robert Boyd, News 10. Thank you, Robert. Um